Who do you think Megan is training? So I think you're talking about Megan Trainer, but I like to think that your theory is that in Megan 2, she's like training another robot. I've already told you that for me, Megan 1 is about one Megan. In Megan 2, the source code gets leaked, and then there's like an army of Megans, and then at the end of Megan 2, we see like a package arrive in North Korea, and then like somebody in full North Korean military garb opens up the package and it's a Megan. And then Megan 3 is like a full on war between like the NATO countries and the North Korean army, which now consists exclusively of Megans. Another way you could possibly do it, okay, Megan 1, it went the same way that it did. Megan 2, Megan's source code comes out, like it leaks, but then it gets into like Ghost in the Shell style, it breaks into the network like Ghost Rider and it starts overwriting the code of other toys. So like now Tickle Me Elmo's are turning homicidal and like Furbies and stuff like that and Kindle e-readers. And then the, if they make a third movie, it could be like the humanity against the Megan super intelligence. But I don't know. I kind of like the, the John Wick style. The John Wick style one a little more. But you can have some great kills with Megan taking over the network. You're right. Like if Megan took over my Peloton, they could show me clipping my my feet into the pedals, and then the the, the wheels just keep spinning faster. Oh, oh, Samuel, stop, stop! Oh, and then like my my legs disconnect from my pelvis or something like that. And then just like you see my my legs just by themselves pedaling, even though like, I've fallen off the bike or something like that. That could be a great moment, man. That could be a... Oh, man. That could... Blumhouse, you can have that one for free. Honestly, I would just love to see that finally brought to the silver screen. Whew. Um, well, obviously, we'll take a legendary. 